First Alert Weather with Chief Meteorologist Haley Clawson. Well, today has been a pretty sticky day in the desert. You step outside and there is a difference compared to what we were feeling yesterday. Blue sky overhead, but temperatures have actually been still staying below average. Despite all of the sunshine, an average high for today's date would be 109. Right now in Palm, uh, Palm Desert, 102 degrees. Plenty of sunshine, but you can see those cumulus clouds right over the mountains. Even more clouds just towards our east. But the whole reason we're so sticky is because of this. Look at these dew point temperatures in the 60s. Once we cross that 60 threshold, it is just muggy when you step outside, sometimes just not all that pleasant, especially when you're compare, uh, dealing with it with also triple digit uh, temperatures when we're talking about our air temperature. And this is actually going to be our setup as we head through the rest of tonight and even head through the weekend. We are dealing with this increase in moisture because of what is all towards our east that is headed west. Now we got a little bit of this yesterday, at least across the high desert. We saw those storms working their way down even in the overnight hours into early this morning. Similar setup now, except instead of thunderstorms, they fizzled out over Arizona, but those showers are beginning to work their way into San Bernardino County high desert. Seeing a few little showers as well down in Imperial County. We can expect that same trend once again tonight. Night. So as we head overnight, I'm looking to see more of that activity work its way into Southern California deserts. Still, we're going to be dealing with passing clouds uh, as we head overnight, those showers moving across the high desert. But it's as we head into our Saturday that thunderstorm chances will begin to increase for closer to home. I'm talking about our high desert right here, closer to Joshua Tree National Park, as well as for our local mountains as we head through the later morning hours and then more so into the early afternoon. We'll really begin to see those clouds pop up, those tall, uh, towering cumulus clouds. Now moving into Sunday, Still, storm chances are there, but we're looking to see an increase in coverage across Southern California with more of that moisture moving farther towards the west, involving more of Southern California rather than just the deserts. So that's our trend that we're looking at on our first alert comfort air seven day forecast. Best opportunity for the Coachella Valley to see some of that rain is going to be on Saturday, but still we're keeping those storm chances in place through Monday. John Karen.